My name is Shauna Thompson and I'm the Vice President of Servicing and ATM Operations. What I'm most proud of being a 20-year employee of BECU is that it doesn't matter our size, we always have our eye on the member and the member experience is definitely something that no decision is made without considering. Having the ability to have better insight into what's happening at our ATMs, especially with using the iNetco Analytics tool, has been invaluable to us. What makes BEC unique is that we have an operating model that is very remote. We have over 40 branches, but only two of those branches have the traditional teller line where they have the full cash services. We are very dependent upon our ATMs to provide that service to our members at the non-traditional cash branches. I'm Shirley Taylor. I have been with BECU for 29 years now and have the privilege of being responsible for our ATM delivery channel. With Inetco Analytics, the key uh, processes that we were able to really focus in on was, um, first of all, taking a look at lease renewals for existing ATMs. That process typically took us about 10 plus hours at a minimum to gather all of the data and we've now been able to reduce that down to two hour at the max uh, mark for pulling all of that information together and being able to present with the recommendation. One of the other key um, areas we've been able to really make some improvements in is our um, reporting and analysis on cash utilization. We probably average about 10 plus hours a week manually just trying to track and, and make sure that we're, we're on point with where we need to be and that's through multiple spreadsheets and data sources. Uh, with the analytics, um, we are able to actually look at the dashboard, change our time frames, focus in on specific ATMs, look at the entire fleet, and have all the information right there as to what our cash utilization is. We're also able to set targets as to what our expected utilization would be, and so we can look at that and where it's hitting on the trend line and, and where things are going. The other thing that um, is really key for us is um, the ability to do a full network and regional um, geographical analysis on our ATMs. Where all are they located? Where are our gaps? How are they performing? Um, and what is it overall that we need to do strategically to be able to really make sure that we're serving the members' needs as well as um, have a balanced network that's performing at the appropriate levels.